like kind of a few minutes apart just so I don't miss waking up. I have one that goes off at 8.25. I plan on just setting my alarm for 6 a.m. and just going with it. Waking up bright and early. I'm not a morning person. Can be tough. Well, I have not done anything to prep for school. Well, sleeping wise. But it's the sleep children's bodies need that helps with the transition from Wake up. The teacher's right there. To Well, I'm not so excited about school. Dr. David Hill, a local family practice physician, says a good night's rest is important for kids as they return back to school. That helps them uh, keep keep on track with their with their work, keep on track in the class. For elementary students Beatrice and Miles Yost, he recommends at least eight hours a night. For middle and high school students like Kiana Gaiona, six to seven hours. Can impinge on things like attention span. It's kind of hard to teach a child that they're they're asleep with their head on the desk. Dr. Hill says the parents notice their child not performing well in school. Then it's best to ask their teacher. Sometimes it's uh, uh, could be one of the attention disorders. And get a head start. Training the body now could help you for the first day of class. I love sleeping. If I could sleep all day, 24-7, I would.